The DARPA Robotics Challenge was a showcase for how very large, very expensive robots could potentially be useful in disaster recovery and high-risk environments. Humanoids are particularly capable in some very specific situations, but the rest of the time, well, they're probably overkill. And using smaller, cheaper, more specialized robots is much more efficient. This is especially true when you're concerned with data collection as opposed to manipulation. For the search part of the search and rescue, for example, you're better off with lots of very small robots covering as much ground as possible versus a large one that kind of clunkily maneuvers through the disaster. DARPA has announced a new program called SHRIMP. It stands for Short Range Independent Micro Platforms. Boy, they're lucky that spelled out shrimp, aren't they? The goal is to develop and demonstrate multifunctional micro to milli robotic platforms for use in natural and critical disaster scenarios, all to enable robots that are both tiny and useful. Shrimp will support fundamental research in the component parts that are, well, the most difficult to engineer, including actuators, mobility systems, and power storage. Imagine a natural disaster scenario, such as, say, an earthquake that inflicts widespread damage to buildings and structures, critical utilities and infrastructure, and threatens human safety. Having the ability to navigate the rubble and enter highly unstable areas could prove invaluable to saving lives or detecting additional hazards among all the wreckage. One of the best things about DARPA programs like these is their competitive nature, and SHRIMP is no exception. Both components and integrated robots will compete in a series of Olympic-themed competitions for multifunctional millimeter to centimeter scale robotic platforms, performing tasks associated with maneuver ability, dexterity, and manipulation. DARPA will be splitting the competition into two parts, one for actuators and power sources, and the other for complete robots. Capable of performing events like the high jump, long jump, weightlifting, and shot putt, DARPA expects that the teams will develop systems that weigh less than one gram and fit into one cubic centimeter. DARPA has $32 million of funding to spread around across multiple projects for shrimp. Abstracts are due August 10th, proposals are due September 26th, and the competition could happen as early as March of next year.